Hey guys, it's Karina here with another Plan With Me video in my mini Happy Planner. And I'm just going to show you that um, for anybody who hasn't seen my setup, this is my Happy Planner inside a B6 Traveler's Notebook. I've slipped the back cover into the pocket. And what's key here is that the pocket is actually um, a secretary pocket. And that is my alarm on my phone telling me to go pick up my daughter. Ah, turn that off. I'm going to go pick her up as soon as this is done. <laughs> and then... I'll just show you last week's spread for Monday, January 22nd through January 28th, where I use stickers from the Daydreamer sticker book and the Choose Happy Mini Happy Planner book. And then these washi tapes are from Pretty Cute Planner. So for this week, January 29th through February 4th, I'm calling it February 3rd all this time, go. I'll be using leftover pieces of the Party Penguins kit from Green Darner Designs. I've already used this in the fitness planner insert, so now I wanna show you how I'm gonna use it in the mini happy planner. So let's get started. I'm just gonna make a note here to everybody that I did go pick up my daughter. I was on time to pick her up from school, so no worries, just got a quick planning in here. Anyway, first thing I did with this bread is find a full box to cover the corner there. And then I'm gonna take this notes sticker to cover up that top part there. I've already used the date covers in this kit for the fitness spread and I don't normally use the date covers actually in the mini kits but I was glad that I left this note section because it actually helps it to stick out a bit more. So I did something a little bit different this week. Instead of placing the full box sticker in the middle uh, on that part of Monday, I decided to actually stick it right on the left side of the Monday horizontal box and then place my to-do box for Tuesday right there. Trying to play around with the placement of stickers a little bit for me. And then Thursday, instead of in the bottom left-hand corner where it normally goes, I stuck it right there going a little bit out of my comfort zone but you know what I decided let's play around with the placement because I know functionally what I need in the spread which work shifts I need to place where um, which events are happening on which day so functionally I know what I need and then I can work around that with the decoration so I know normally I need a to-do list on Tuesdays I need a three or a mini three checklist for Thursdays and then I will need something um, similar to that on Saturday and then in terms of my work shifts or other events then I can just dot them around the, the spread. So Friday is normally fun corner Friday and I like to decorate that with a full box. And then this cute Hello Weekend banner, instead of placing it on the line horizontally I like to place it like that as just added decoration something a bit different. I feel like this whole spread is a little bit out of my comfort zone just because of where I'm placing the stickers. You don't necessarily need to place the stickers directly in line with the horizontal boxes. You can place them layered, you can place them off center. Shake up your world a little bit. So like I was saying before, I know functionally what is happening in the week. So I'm able to place the functional stickers down and then decorate around that. I know I need to pick up groceries on Friday night. So hence I place a little bit of space there for the grocery sticker. I also know when my work shifts are happening. So I'm actually using the snowflakes in the deco sheet to notate my work shifts for the week. So you don't necessarily need to use functional stickers. You can actually use the deco pieces for functional purposes. And then I'm just going to place a few of the deco stickers around the spread. I'm trying to use a bit much, as much of this kit as possible, but mostly it is white space. I do like to leave a lot of room for writing just in case anything comes up. And I had a hard time placing this last deck. I'm like, where the heck do I put it? And I think I was rushing myself because I'm like, no, I got to pick up my daughter. I got to pick up my daughter. And then I just place it there. And then I wanted to find a quote to place on Fun Corner Friday. So I'm looking through all my sticker books and this is the Daydreamer um, sticker book from me and my big ideas. 
and I'm flipping and I'm flipping and I couldn't find anything. I wanted something to match the color scheme, but I also wanted a little bit of gold foil. In the end, you know, that sticker didn't work. And Harry, I'm rushing myself because I'm like, I gotta go pick up my daughter. And a lot of my plan with these, I do take a bit of time to flip through the sticker books. And eventually I will find a quote to put perfectly into the bottom right hand corner. But that is it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. It was a very quick plan with me. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and have yourselves a great day.